left the parking lot. And it doesn't seem like a too far a walk. Uh, I'm not really, really sure what to go. I see people up here, so I'm going to go up to the mountain, top of the mountain coast. And then there's a concrete walking trail down that way. So. Okay, yeah. Alright, so now we come around the back side of the rocks. Look at this, though. The sun is about ready to set. Looks like a couple of people camping out, though. That's pretty cool. Maybe I spend the night here. Here somewhere? Right, right there. Oh, wow. And then there's some cool ones kind of along this side. Oh, along that side, right where yeah. that guy's yeah. filming? Yeah, where my husband Just look for dark rocks with you the look for, Yeah, dark rocks where you see the white stuff sticking through because they basically just take a rock and chip, 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 chip to come up with art. Okay. Um, See, like right there is something, but the rock is busted. Yeah, so they they just kind of wear away the outside, and create they kind of wear away the outside of it. Yeah, to create the art. Yeah. Yeah, and there's a really around the corner is it's a face. It's kind of like on the where a rock comes together. And then a face kind of reflecting. Why is the lighter color? Is the inside of the lock lighter than the outside? Right, right. Because the outside, they call it a patina, but it just ages. Uh -huh. And so it turns dark. And then, then they can use the rocks to make the whiter stuff. In fact, here's a good example here. You can see the white under, and then, the, you know, it has the dark on the outside. Yeah. And then white once you take off the dark. And then and then they use, and then they, the Native Americans take the, their rock and just chitter away the patina. Right, right, right. With another rock. Yep. Just for art's sake. Yeah. Or at least it could be. could be there's religious significance to it. Or, or they just want to... You know, record what their how their life is. Right, that could very well be. You know, because you know they they have a a, a deer a thing, communication. Yes, yeah, so it's pretty cool. Yeah, it is. I see the seem seem huge ones somewhere, and as they like to say they they was like trying to talk to the aliens and stuff, but I don't know. Yeah, now have you? In Albuquerque, right outside of Albuquerque, is like gobs of different panels, kind of like this. Only they're they're, I mean, they must be new or something, but they stand out more. But I mean, there are hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of things, and they're, I think it's like Petroglyph Petroglyph National Monument or something like that. But if you've got time to get to Albuquerque. That is, that really shows you what petroglyphs are for. You know, just because you just see a lot of them. A lot of them are repeats. Yeah, I have a cookie that's the north of the state. Uh, well, actually, let's see, where are we at? Albuquerque's probably over there. It's kind of, kind of in the center north of the state. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'd probably be through there again, but not yeah, this time. Not this time, but you'll need to stop by there at some point. All uh, right, you hear that? Everybody hit the like, so give me a reason to. All right. Yep, you take care. There's, so there are like three different creeks that come together in, right, around yeah. here? Which I, on the map, that's kind of what it looks like. Okay, and so they call this area the three rivers? Yeah, there's actually three creeks. Three creeks. <laughs> All right. So that's, that's a nice one right there. We walk right by it is an arrow. Arrow and it points right to the sun. Look at that. The little man with happy face. 
Hello. And here's the little one on the rock right here. And there's another one right there. Another one right here. <laughs> Which ones for Alice? What you have? You found anything interesting? Animals with arrows in them, faces yep. on rocks for 3D, all sorts of stuff. Yep. You'll you'll be amazed. Oh yeah, there's all sorts of stuff. There's geometric designs. That to me looks like a T-Rex, but obviously not a T-Rex. <laughs> faces. Some of my favorites are um, there's hunting. There's not the faces. Faces. It does not stop. Let me see if I can find my favorite favorite. I think these are all done by the orthopedic side. Let's see. Hold on. Hi. That's not it. There's one of a there's a guy that's totally awesome. Well maybe you can send me these. Let me see. What you want to see, you know, it's kinda of like you know, you you only can see what you know. What it is, you know, because half of seeing is 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 believing, and half of believing is seeing. And if you you know, if you don't know what something is, you're not really going to be able to see it. You know, like I couldn't even see these these pay, these stones until this old man pointed them out to me while I was looking at it. It was kind of crazy. Um, even though they right there, you know. And then people look at these some of these these stones and they like what is it that I'm looking at? And it's like you know when Christopher Columbus came over here, they thought they wore they the cells were clouds and they thought they wore it in on clouds, and they were some must be some type of gods because they. So, you know, so yes, yeah, believing is seeing, and seeing is believing. Yeah, and you can walk right by something and doesn't even see it. It's amazing, you know? Way the war is in, there's so many things that we, We'll just go right by every day and we don't even see. So many wonders, so many things, and so many magical things in this world that we don't even see. We don't even know that they are here. But they are. You know, Native American said one time, you know, in order to see Bigfoot, you must first believe in Bigfoot, you know. If a Bigfoot was walking by here, you wouldn't even be able to see it if you didn't believe it. <laughs> so, you know, you just got to be able to have, open your eyes and open your mind because that way... You able to see the things you are able to see more and able to do more. Or otherwise you're just gonna walk by something and not even see it. Yeah. And those are real. Some, so, some. So it's got to be real because they wouldn't have it marked. Because some of them are. Yeah. Are graffiti. Sure, of course. Yeah. But that, those are. Is that cool? Yeah. That's just really cool. Because I saw that peace sign back there, and I'm like, that's Aww. that's 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 a modern symbol. That's like, sure. that I don't think the Native Americans. Thousands of years ago, be painting peace signs and rocks.
I mean, I could be wrong, but you know. No. Real? I'm certain. You gotta open your eyes and know what's real and not real. It seems like the the ones that are real are darker. Like you can, can you really have because over time they, they they build up this patina as a way to kind of tell what's real or not and what's not. What were those about? Those are crystals. Oh, really? The crystal, probably, black crystals? Probably black. Oh, wow. Mountains covered with them. I didn't know that the crystals were here. It's another thing. Like, if you don't know, you don't even see them. But now that you know that they're here, now you can see them. Say structure. We we'll play a little picnic area. People can sit here. It's not completely, you know, shelter from elements. You know, there's a lot of gaps in the wood and stuff. And there's graffiti, of course, which is okay because this is not like part of the what it is. The mountain, you know, this is good. So I guess if you want to defeat this is the place to do it. Um. Yeah. Snake in a hand and a fire bird. This is another real one. Looking across this mountain range and right there, this little white dot is a little cross and it's like, oh. Uh, open your hearts and open your mind. Open your hearts and open your mind. Open your hearts and open your mind. It's open your hearts and you will find heaven. Open your hearts and open your mind. Up your heart and up your mind Up your heart and up your mind Never know what you will find Never know what you will find Up your heart and up your mind Up your heart and up your mind Up your heart and up your mind Up your heart and you will find Never know the path to take you Never know Never know what you will find. Never know where you find. Open your hearts and open your mind. Hey, open your hearts and open your mind. Open your hearts, open your mind. Open your hearts and you will find. Hey, open your hearts and open your mind. Open your hearts and you will find. Never know where the path lead you. Never know. And I say, open your eyes, 
The war to see the live white we pay. The war to see the open your eyes. The war will be there. Oh, open your eyes. And you will see a sea of dove. You will never saw. See something you never think before. And open your eyes. And you open your see. Open your eyes. You will find love. There will be a love out there. People that love and you there'll be someone to love you today. If you open your hearts, open your hearts and open your hearts, they will be there. There will someone that love you today. There will be people love you today. If, if you love them today, if love the world and everyone, everyone you see today, now love of all. People do day now love on people. People do days a new opportunity, new new possibility. Every day is a new disability. Every day is a new possibility. Every day is a new possibility. Every day is a new possibility. Up your hearts and up your mind. Up your hearts and you will find it. Open your hearts, open your mind. Open your hearts and open your mind. Hell yeah, good shit, man. Thank you. Hey, you gotta, you gotta get to that different level of awareness, right? Hell yeah, it's all about about opening your eyes so you can see. Open your mind, your heart, your soul, everything. Yeah. All right, bro. Stay up. Okay.